it's Amanda. Welcome back to my channel. We are doing part two of my back to school series. We are going to be doing hair now. Today I'm going to be doing three simple and easy back to school hair tutorials that are just going to be easy with the timing because you know sometimes in the morning you don't have time to do your hair and your makeup and all that fun stuff. So these are super quick and easy and efficient, especially if your hair is dirty or anything of the sort. So I got you, girl. I also wanted to note that my back to school series is in partnership with Sally Beauty and so is this video so all the products I'm gonna be using all the hair tools and brushes and all that fun stuff can be found at Sally Beauty so be sure to go check that out and without further ado let's get started so this is my hair without brushing it or without basically just um, styling it or any braids or anything of the sort so that's what we're starting off with the first hairstyle that I'm going to be showing you guys is the quick and easy braid that I do especially when my hair is dirty my hair is clean right now but this applies for people with clean and dirty hair so the first step to this is splitting your hair in a line and put a little bit more on this side than the other side depending on like what hand you write with I feel like that's the easiest way to explain it and then you're gonna want to grab this hair and place it on the side where the line has more of the hair and you're gonna want to get your wet and dry brush and you're gonna want to brush it so it's all nice and easy so there's no knots and everything is smooth sailing so to start off what I'll do is I'll grab a little piece of hair at the top front and I'm going to split this into three different sections and in the three different sections you're just going to start braiding and as you go pick up more hair on each side so as I brought this down I'm going to grab a little bit of hair right here and just keep on braiding and picking up hair as I go and this will just be a lot easier when you're going down with the braid you're picking a product, keeping it in place, especially if your hair is not done. This also helps if your hair is frizzy, like me, I have extremely frizzy hair. And I always do this, especially when I was in high school, it's something that I did all the time and will probably be doing. So you're just gonna wanna keep going down with the braid all the way down. And then when you reach like where the back of the hair is, you're gonna wanna pick up bigger pieces as you go just so you make sure that you get your whole head of hair and I'm just going to be braiding this all the way down I am going to be tying this with a hair tie and you're gonna want to now tease a little bit and take out a little bit of the pieces and kind of just stretch it out so it is a little bit softer and it looks a little bit less tight it takes me like two to three minutes to do it's super easy and it's just like my go-to hairstyle especially if my hair is frizzy or just not like ironed or fixed or anything and so yeah and if you tend to have like baby hairs that fly and stuff like I do and you kind of want to make sure that this stays in place I use some bobby pins these are the salon care supreme bobby pins you can find these at Sally's and I take like two of them I take like two of them and I kind of use it in an X kind of thing just to keep your hair back so it doesn't move throughout the day because that kind of happens to me. So yeah, I kind of just use it to keep my hair back and out of my face throughout the day and that is the first hairstyle. Super easy and I love doing this. So starting off fresh and clean, I'm going to grab a little bit of hair from the front of my face and what I'm gonna do is like a little mini braid so what you're gonna want to do is grab a little bit of hair and just braid that section only and pick up a little bit of hair as you go from the same section that you pulled hair from and you're gonna take the same salon care bobby pins and just pin it in place And we're going to do the same thing to this part of the hair. And we're just going to be pinning it into place. And the finishing touch to this is this argan oil treatment just to make sure that your ends don't look dry. And I'm just going to be taking a little bit of that and just applying that on the ends of my hair just so they're nice and moisturized. And this smells amazing. This is super good if you want your hair out of your face during the day because sometimes when my hair gets in my face, it's really annoying and 
just keeps it out super easy super quick simple and I just think it's super cute okay and the last hairstyle is a continuation of this so you're gonna want to do is take your wet and dry brush kind of make sure that you have no knots in there for the back I don't like using super loose kind of brushes I like using this one this is the brush strokes brush from Sally Beauty and it's kind of like a thin bristle so this just really helps make sure that the back is gonna stay smooth and down and so you're just gonna keep on brushing to make sure that everything is back and now you're just gonna take a hair tie and secure that in place and another trick that I have if you have baby hairs like I do and they're out of control I like to use this hairspray this is the Tresemme ultra fine hairspray it doesn't leave your hair looking crunchy or shiny when you use it and just any spoolie and what I'll do is I'll put a little bit or a lot of hairspray and just basically slay them a little bit so they're not frizzy and that they don't look like they're out of place because sometimes you know when you take a selfie and you see your baby hairs going crazy you don't want that especially when you're starting school again so I'm just gonna be putting hairspray as I go and just slay them a little bit so they are in place and don't move and there you have it it's a super easy way to keep your hair back especially if you're doing sports or anything in the day and it's super cute and it's super put together I love hairstyles like this because even though your hair is held back it still helps frame your face you look amazing and it's just super cute for school and I actually really like this so and the best part is that it takes literally zero to no time to do it's super quick and easy and perfect for back to school alrighty guys so that is all for today's video thank you guys so much for watching be sure to let me know if you use any of these hairstyles when you go back to school and be sure to tweet me some pictures or send them to me I'd love to see that if you guys want to check out any of the products that I use in this video they're from Sally Beauty I love you guys I hope you have an amazing time when you guys go back to school and I will see you in my next video